I made it back! So we've been in Kona for about three weeks and I guess I should give you an update of what I've been doing since I've been back. So let's go! roughly and uh, I've gone back into my regular routine so in the morning I've been in the cafe just serving our staff as well as our students and through that I've been able to be a part of the barista track which happened in July and so every week we get to have um, the students come in on Wednesday and we get to teach them a different aspect of coffee and what that looks like and what that ministry looks like so that's been super fun and then we also get to have them in our cafe during the afternoon uh, so that they get to practice their skills and that's been really fun to just see them um, see them just grow and learn about the ministry and learn more about coffee and just get excited about it and, and I've gotten to learn a lot about them as well especially because two of them are Canadians which is awesome so we get to bond over that obviously and bond over coffee so that's been super fun and then in the afternoon I've been back in Gateway it's been a bit of a transition just because um, one of my co-workers actually left her commitment was over and so she went back home um, and so that's been really testing just to be in that specific role by myself has been a little bit overwhelming but one of the things that the Lord um, shared with me at the beginning of the year was just the word trust and so over the last two and a half weeks the Lord has just been constantly going Jayla like do you trust me and so that's just been a real eye-opener to just really focus on seeking the Lord in this time and what does it mean to trust the Lord and and how can I trust him in this season where I'm overwhelmed um, and a little bit just chaotic sometimes I feel and so even though I've been going through that just seeing the Lord come in those moments and just give me peace and understanding and just knowing that like yes this is a tough season but tough seasons come and go and that's where you grow and that's where I get to thrive and and really see the Lord work in my life and I do trust that people will come but this is the type of ministry where people come and people go and just learning that um, through that it'll all come together because I'm here to serve the Lord and through that I want to see His glory come and it's also been super great because even though I'm the only one in that role there's also other people in this ministry, the medical ministry um, and the registration aspect of it. So the other um, people that I've been working with have been just so awesome just being supportive and asking how they can help me and, and we've been coming together and seeing like how can we make these medical outreaches in Papua New Guinea really like thrive and how can we thrive to see um, the outreaches succeed and see God just come and move in that nation and so that's been really fun and we've really been working together as a team and I'm really excited to see what the Lord's going to be bringing in that area. We actually just finished our first outreach in July, our two-week medical outreach in Mount uh, Higgins, so that's been really good. And we have our, another, uh, our next outreach at the end of August, so I'm really excited to get more, some more updates and some more stories and news and see how the Lord's going and then share that with you. So that's pretty much what's been going on with me. I'm excited to uh, share more about that in the coming videos as well as the barista track. So, Keep watching and you guys will see more of that in the coming weeks. Bye!